my name is Melissa. This is my first YouTube video. I'm a mom of four, married. Um, we've been living in our house here for about nine years and it was built in 1900. So we are redoing our house and fixing everything, landscaping, all sorts of things. I'll be making videos about that. I love to craft. I make tons of um, decorations for the house and I love decorating. I love fashion, makeup, all sorts of things, nature videos. I'm gonna make tons of stuff. So if you're interested in following along, please subscribe and welcome to my new channel. So the kids are back in school and I feel ready to clean and decorate again. Um, this area, is, we're in my front mudroom of my house. I need to clean the whole mudroom, but for right now, I'm going to start by focusing on these shelves because as soon as I start to decorate something, then I want to clean everything and get a whole room done because of one area I worked on. So anyway, um, this is kind of what I've got going on now. If you want to see me kind of, I don't know if you want to say like modernize the shelf decorations or just change it up because I'm kind of tired of this look, then keep watching. So this is my front mudroom. Um, this is the shelf I'll be redecorating today. If you know me, you would know I love glitter. I had made, um, painted a bunch of sticks at one time. Um, glitter. I have a glitter wall. If you haven't noticed, I have to dust in all of that. Um, but I love Victorian era things. Gilded mirrors are some of my favorites. They're all over my house. But this just feels too girly for me. It's not really my vibe anymore, if you want to say that. I don't really love the pastel flowers and... I don't know, too much pink. I'm not really a pink person. I tried it out, it was fun for a while, but it's time to switch it up, so here we go. This is the haul. Some of it is a haul, some of it's stuff that I've already had. I'm gonna try some of these things out on the shelf. I love plants. I have around 70 plants, I think, right now. Um, real house plants. But I wanna do some easy stuff that I don't have to water as often because I just want easy and also we have a dog who wigs her tail right by the front door and knocks stuff over that's on the shelf so I have to make sure that I be careful where I place things so it doesn't make a mess in here for me daily but this is some of the stuff I got most of it is from Walmart um, and we'll see what I'm gonna use and go from there this lamp at um, Dollar Family Dollar a long time ago and I had added um, little jewels inside of it because I was going for that pink theme um, but I don't want to do that anymore so I thought how cute would it be I was gonna get rid of this lamp um, but it has this really um, narrow lampshade so it doesn't stick out past my shelf and I feel like that's kind of hard to find and so I thought, how cute would it be, instead of doing gems, to do some moss. You can get this at Walmart, or I think even Dollar Tree you can get some there. So I'm going to try putting that inside here and see how that looks. Probably should have done this before I dusted, but it is because it is very messy. But I think that will end up looking so cool. So I'm unsure if I still want to use this birdcage or not. I think I do. I really still like the look of this. 
um, my dog. This was a dog tail casual tee and it's never been the same. So I'm gonna throw that away because it's broken. But look at this, it's so cute from Walmart. It was two, almost $3, I think, under three bucks. And it fits right in here and I'm able to put it inside the little bird cage and it just looks so cute and pulls in the little gardeny green theme that I was going for. I love that. It's so cute. guys the front mudroom decor is all done at least on this shelf um, I love how it turned out let me know what you guys think down in the comments uh, it's kind of like a farmhouse chic or whatever but it still has touches of my Victorian um, era and also some glam thrown in there as well it's very simple, not messy, um, not too much clutter. It's a little clutter, a little bit, but I am loving it. I'm very happy with it. So I'll leave some pictures and hope you like it. Quick rundown of where everything is from. Um, this was a thrift store vase that my dad gave me for free and it was a dark brown color. I painted it white and sanded it and it turned out so beautifully. Um, the lamb's ear was from Walmart as was this little plant. Um, I think that one was $6. Um, this was from an antique store. It is, I believe, from the 70s, which is also my favorite era, if you guys know me. It's 70s and it's um, Victorian era. This little basket was from Dollar Tree, so cute. Um, I told you guys the lamp was from Family Dollar. The moss was from um, Walmart. This is a beautiful tin, and this was from Walmart as well, and so were the ferns that I put in it. You know, they're like coming out with so much better looking fake plants than they used to. I love them. Um, and then this also was from Walmart on clearance right now for three bucks. And um, as I let you know, this was from Family Dollar. The little thing in here was Walmart. This is from Dollar Tree so one buck for that um, my friend made me that super cute and then uh, that's a canvas and then this was from Walmart also it's a Better Homes and Gardens one I believe sorry about the cars driving by these were on Amazon they're like real salt candelabra holders um, this is vintage it's like a jewelry holder you guys can find tons of these um, in antique shops everywhere this little uh, planter is also a real planter, as is that one. They both have holes in the bottom if you want to put real plants in them. And this one was only one buck right now at Walmart. I thought it was so cute. And so all these succulents were from there as well. And then this little, um, uh, <laughs> sorry, I'm blanking on the word. The lantern, I think, was about seven bucks from Walmart. And then these books were both from a garage sale, but you can find tons of really beautiful vintage books at thrift stores as well so i believe that's where everything is from um, my husband made the shelf and this was from my sister she got it at target around christmas time but it's so beautiful it gets to stay here year round and my friend actually gave me the mirror for free and i want to glitter more walls in my house but my husband probably wouldn't be very excited about that. So <laughs> I get one glitter drama wall, at least for now. So much for joining me today on my very first YouTube video. I'm so glad that you're here. Don't forget to subscribe if you wanna follow along and see what else is to come.